so to install this uh, board into your Arduino ID you have to click here on install button hello everyone welcome to mectox pro youtube channel we thank all our subscribers and viewers for all the support and encouragement you have given to us in previous video series about raspberry pi pico we have seen all the basic information unboxing software hardware setup for raspberry pi pico we have also seen pico can be programmed with c c++ or python using thony ide in this video we will see how to program Raspberry Pi Pico using an Arduino ID. For that we need to add this board core into an Arduino ID. This Arduino core for RPi Pico is available now but it is not the official one. This probably will take its time to get official. But this guy Al Appilauer published an unofficial support which is for Raspberry Pi Pico Arduino Core for all RP2040 boards. This port of RP2040 Raspberry Pi Pico processor to the Arduino ecosystem. It uses custom tool set with GCC 10.2 and newly 4.0.0 not depending on system installed prerequisite. This is automatic discovery of boards in a bootloader mode. So they show up in the ID and the upload command works using Microsoft EF2 tool. So let's see the procedure of installing via Arduino Boards Manager. For Windows users, please do not use Windows Store version of actual Arduino application because it has an issue detecting attached Pico boards. Use Windows Zip or plain Windows Executable.exe download directed from Arduino.cc and allow all the installation of drivers as it suggests during installation. Otherwise, Pico board may not get detected. Okay, so this is the procedure. We will see this procedure in detail. In this video, we will see procedure of installation with screenshot. Then we will see demonstration of this core installation on an actual system. Then we will see LED fading program using this Arduino ID and installed core onto that. So this is the procedure to how to program Raspberry Pi Pico using Arduino ID. All these are given instruction. First you have to download and install the Arduino ID if you have not installed it. Then this is the procedure to install the raspberry pi pico board in your arduino id so let's see all this uh, information one by one so first you have to download and install the arduino id as per your system like windows mac os or linux and you can install with this link we will share this link in the description of video then after that open the arduino id after you installed it and go to file and preferences here in a file and preferences the preferences window will get open here this is the preferences window you have to enter this text in a additional board manager url field this is the additional board manager url field you have to enter this text into this field and if you have installed earlier other boards like esp8266 and esp32 their links also be present there so you have to separate those links with the comma here they have given enter a comma for a separate list of urls so this is for raspberry pi pico if they're for esp32 or esp8266 you have to separate them with the comma and then click on ok next go to tools here and then boards manager here tools on a toolbar arduino you have to go to tools then board and boards manager this boards manager window will get open like this you have to search raspberry or raspberry pi pico into this search bar and the board which is supported by this earl f will get listed here 
Raspberry Pi Pico. You have to click on install here to install it in your Arduino IDE. Then next it will take time and it will require internet connection to install this board into your Arduino IDE. So keep note of that. It will take few minutes to install then you can verify uh, this board got installed or not here it will show installed here you can also verify going to tools and then boards here you can see that uh, raspberry pi pico board rp2040 will get listed here and the uh, supporting rp2040 boards like uh, adaput freezer adaput feather rp2020 Microprobe and generic RP2040 all this got listed here in uh, other boards like other boards Arduino ESP32 ESP8266 and all other AVR boards of Arduino So this was the procedure for Windows users to installing via Arduino boards manager They have also given installing via git procedure all the commands you can check out that then they have given installing on Linux also. So Tom's hardware presented a very nice write-up on installing Arduino Pico on both Windows and Linux on this link. So this is the link where they have given how to program Raspberry Pi Pico in Arduino IDE for Linux. They have used Ubuntu for this tutorial but the same instruction should work for other Debian based distribution such as Raspberry Pi OS. So they have given stepwise procedure with screenshot to install it on Linux also. You can check out that for your installation in Linux. Now let's see on Windows because we have Windows machine we will see installing via Arduino Boards Manager for Windows users. So you have to first go to your Arduino ID. So this is the Arduino ID. You have to go to file and then preferences. This is the toolbar where the, you will find the option file. Then you have to go to preferences here. So this is the preferences window where you have to go to this additional board manager URL field. So you can see here on this additional board manager URL. The other boards like ESP32 and ESP8266 links already present because we have installed those boards earlier. You have to separate here these links with comma enter comma separated list of URLs. So put comma here and paste the URL which we have seen earlier. This URL you have to copy this URL and then paste this URL into here additional board managers URL field with separate by comma. Okay, this is for RP2040 you can see here and then click on OK. Now next go to tools here and go to boards and boards manager. Okay, tools, board and boards manager. The boards manager window will get open and you can see other boards here which you have already installed. Okay. You have to search here for Raspberry Pi. You can see here the Raspberry Pi Pico RP2040 by supported by Earl F. Filhauer board got listed here. This is the search or you can search also for Raspberry Pi Pico also. Okay, same board will get listed here. You can see here it is supported other boards like Adaput Feather RP2040 generic RP2040 module. So to install this uh, board into your Arduino IDE you have to click here on install button. So you require internet connection because it will download the board's definitions from this link. You can see here it will take time to install this board. So we will fast forward this video. Okay, now you can see installation is completed and you can verify this also here. The board is got installed here. Okay, you will see the remove option here. So can, now you can close this uh, boards manager and you can also verify that board 
is got installed by checking here on a boards and boards manager here you can see the raspberry pi pico or pi 2040 boards got listed here and other boards like uh, my pico probe had a put breather all this got listed here and it shows that we have successfully installed the rp2040 raspberry pi core into an arduino ide this was for how to install this board into an arduino ide now let's program this board 